last week I know I did we got some stuff going on this week but right now it's raining it's raining right now it doesn't look like it but it is it's just dark rain it's supposed to rain all day we even have tornado warnings today sort of but uh anyways let's see what we can get going on all right guys I'm here around the steiner right now uh, we're already having mechanical problems you know go fine backwards but forwards and only do a crawl and I'm stopping with my dealer and they say you probably got a stretch cable so uh, they often come down and fix it or whatever but uh, I said I'll drop it off after we get done but it's off the slow going anyway guys off to work it's gone guys it's uh, Wednesday morning we had a dirty old shower last night. Thunder and lightning, all that stuff. Yeah, we finally got water, which is amazing. It's cooled the air down a little bit. It's great. But anyways, off to work. I think we got clean the combine today. All right, guys, we got the combine out. And we're going to open it all up and give her a good blowout and stuff. And then we'll take it over to the shop and do the fine cleaning. Right now, we'll open it all up and get the blowers in it and blow what we can out of it. Get the mass majority of it. And then we'll do the finds. But anyways, I drove her over here. Yes, I can drive these things. <laughs> Not that hard. So, Brent and Chris are out there blowing her all off. We got dust flying. Up. Turn it on. Okay. There you go, old boy. All turned on. These things are pretty uh, basic. After you get going, though, it's just setting the fine tune. They're good to go. Big lawnmower. I don't enjoy running them all that much. I'd rather be the bailing guy or whatever like that. I find this job very boring, actually. <laughs> uh, some people love it. This is right where you want to be. For me, it's boring as you, it can get for as far as you running a combo. <laughs> close and personal with the combine here. Um, I'm the only one who can really get in here on this. We're going to take all this, get every one of these last strands of straw out of here. Make her look brand new again. But anyway, that's what a combine looks like from the inside. Back. Alright guys. Well guys. There's a familiar sight, right? It's my truck. I got my truck back. <laughs> Works good. We're gonna go see these washouts in the driveway here. We got a bad thunderstorm last night. Anyways, we're gonna go up to the farm and we're gonna get the loader and the blade and all that. And we're gonna do the driveway off here. So that's what we're gonna do. I would put the drone up today, but it's way too windy. The wind's blowing like crazy. See it in this tree here. Let's get close enough. Yeah, so, anyways, it's blowing pretty hard. Alrighty, guys. Uh, I gotta stop saying that. But, uh, 
We're on our way out. We got the bucket on the tractor and we got the blade on. We're gonna go smooth the driveway out. Alrighty guys, um, just got the chores done. The old truck back. Um, we're gonna go grab Brent and those guys and I think we're getting burn ready today. So again, another day, not really a whole lot going on. Uh, it's kind of windy out still. Wind's still blowing. Uh, we'll see what happens today, but I don't think much is, I don't think we're, we're going to be doing much. Well guys, Friday. And I'm not sure what we're getting into today. I, uh, we got the barn and stuff ready yesterday, so. There was a couple barns ready yesterday, so now we're just in a wait mode. And this big barn's going out next week, so. We got a little time to do stuff, so. I imagine we'll get into a bunch of little tiny things here today. Oh, okay, guys. Um, there's a hurricane coming. Whatever, kind of thing. Uh, we're just kind of getting everything prepped, put inside. The combine and stuff's got to go inside. Uh, case power goes out, and our generators, our main generators don't work. We got PTO generators, so we make sure we have our tractors out in the front. Of the barn here so we can just go out the door and hook them up too in case the generators don't work so today's a little bit get prepared for that and then maybe a little bit of whipper snipping and stuff we'll see how this goes all right guys i'm well i guess this be sort of lake bill almost broke we're by uh wink wink.com guys are big apple producers around the valley here there's other big apple producers and stuff too but uh apples are a big thing around here for the people who are not from around here watching uh there are a lot of apple orchards here in the valley too uh anyways it's saturday morning here and taking a little scout out and around and we got that hurricane moving in and you can kind of see it there in the back room, background there building up. So anyways, I don't know if we're going to see very much here, but I made it all the way out this way and took in just about every road and in and across and there's not much going on. So I think everyone's getting ready to button down the hatches. So we'll see if we see anything on the way back here by the... It doesn't look good. <laughs> Alrighty guys, I made it canning. Actually, I, I've been the bomb. I've been everywhere. There's not a thing going on. Everyone's kind of either hiding or I'm not sure. It's just <laughs> the only thing I seen going on was leg boys. They were spraying. And I didn't feel I wanted to get up, get thrown up for that. So I was just like, eh, whatever. That's good, but uh. I don't know, I mean, we're getting into harvest time, so I want to try and keep on that theme. Although, we're going to be seeding winter wheat here soon. So there will be a little bit of that going on. But uh, I want to try to stay on the harvest theme here, where we're getting into fall. And there ain't none of that going on, so... <laughs> going home. Going to see what the wife and kids are doing. and Have a regular day. Welcome back guys. It is Sunday. Sunday morning. Um, I just checked everything out back here. Um, yeah, it's very wet. Don't think anything's going to be happening today. Humidity's right up through the roof. You can feel it. Definitely feel that tropical storm or whatever it was, hurricane. But uh, yeah, we didn't get very much of anything. We got a little bit of rain and not much wind, power didn't go out. Apparently it went out a little bit all over the place, but not as much as I bet you they thought it was. Anyways, time to move on. Monday morning, guys. We're here, we're like a fee. Guys are down there. We're getting her done, here we go. All right, guys, I wasn't parked here in the road. I was trying to figure out these guys' name, or the farm name, but uh, couldn't find it. I even looked on Google. But we were out here on the 221. And actually, we're at the other side of Berwick, but I'm on my way back through. 
and the melon grass. So anyways, we got that. Uh, imagine that's uh, fall silage or whatever. Uh, but anyways, we're on to the next thing. Taking it out of the road, too. Alright guys, it's Monday night. Here goes my wife, Nace. Uh, we got the, the seed. From, uh, we're at Lynnhurst right now. You can't really tell there. I guess you can tell. But we're at Lynnhurst. And anyway, so I'm going to take this back, the blobbing in, park it for the night, and then we'll have it for when we need to seed. Right on. Hey guys, uh, Wednesday morning. I'm shipping birds tonight. Uh, not much going on around here today, but, uh, turn that down. But we'll see what, uh, comes out. I'm pretty sure the boys down the road here are digging potatoes today, so, uh, we might sneak in on that if I can. Alright guys, uh, the boys are doing a little bit around their places, rip snipping on lawn, whatever. Um, I gotta get the Steiner, I got the trailer on, but you can't really see it. Uh, I gotta get the Steiner at Van Rostrum's, and there's a few odds and ends going on today. Boys are over there working. So, uh, lots going on. Lots will be going on. So, uh, hold on tight. I'll go figure. Um, we got birds coming in tonight, so I'm gonna go down and help them dump birds, and then I still got birds going, so things are going on. Alright guys, uh, we've already done the top floor. Uh, this will be the basement. There's Keith Schroeder. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're on their way now, guys. Uh, time to go back to work. What's going on, guys? You see, they're shipping behind me. It's midnight, a little bit past. Uh, things are going good so far. Full moon at night. It's clear. And everything's going good. Let's get the birds out of here. All right, guys. The sun's in my eyes. It's Wednesday morning. I still got the same clothes I've had on forever. I need to go home, have a shower. Uh... Maybe we get some a little bit more sleep. But uh we're at the grass. We're here. Uh getting a little sandwich and stuff. And then yeah, I'm just gonna go home and take it easy a little bit today and maybe get out this afternoon and see if there's something going on. I don't know, we'll see, right? Man, that sun is bright. What's going on guys? It's Thursday morning. We're cleaning out. I'm shipping tonight. So few things going on. I had to get a dust mask. I did the first load with no dust mask. and You'll see it in the videos and stuff. But anyway, I shouldn't have did that. But uh, not much going on here. Uh, all we got is playing in the poop this weekend. So, or this week. So, I guess we'll call this episode playing in the poop. <laughs> That's about all's going on. Well, guys, we've broken down Steiner's upstairs broke down. Our case dealer was here. They got what's wrong figured out, but they need the part, and they're going to see if they can find the part. But I already sent the boys to Perot to get the other Steiner. And by the sounds of it, they're here. So, uh, yeah, a little bit, of, and it's already past lunch, so, and they're still up on the second floor, so, a little bit going on. So the rescue has arrived. Hi, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we'll get this rolling and get out of here. Hopefully. Because I got to ship birds tonight. There's more shipping to do tonight. What's going on, guys? We finished cleaning out probably a half hour ago or so. Anyways, I'm here to shut my feet off. This side of the barn's gone tonight. This side of the barn's already gone. Uh, shut the feed off just like they're going for an operation right so they can only have food past it or allowed to have food to a certain time and then time to go for their operation anyway come on guys uh, we're finally uh, my buddy Craig we, we're cleaning out today he mentioned that he was going disking today and I said thank God there's something to film so we're here uh, we're in pro the tracks is way down there where I used to live. I guess we're still in Pro though, so it still counts. Anyways, guys, enjoy the sights. What's going on, guys? Uh, just finishing up. 
bird, the birds are gone tonight, but we're finishing the episode right now. This is then. Uh, I hate to say it, but I'm going to take a little break because there's a there's like a law on what's going on around here right now, and there's not much going on. <laughs> so instead of me chasing nothing, I'm just going to take a break, and when I feel like it's starting to get busy again, I'll get out and around. It's just I'm I get out, and you'll see from this episode nothing <laughs> nothing was around and people have been messaging me and telling me to come drone them and stuff but then uh, they forget this or they stop messaging me and I know the frustration is because usually I'm working or whatever or I can't quite get to you or I'm doing something else and I don't mean to put you off or anything it's just I am busy um but anyways I'm Thanks for watching. Um, like, share, all that stuff. Um, I think this one's called the poop episode or something. I'll figure it out after I do the get everything done on the computer. Uh, thanks for all the groups and stuff. Uh, Keith Schroeder, you're one of my big time supporters. I'm uh, very thankful for you and what your group has done to, with my page and stuff like that. So I'm very thankful for that. Uh, Farming in the Maritimes, uh, all things Annapolis Valley, uh, farm life. I am agriculture proud, modern uh, agriculture equipment, all those groups. You guys, uh, thanks. Uh, and uh, I think that's it. Uh, I'll see you when things get busy again. <laughs>